Hey guys, my name is Rob Balasabas. Welcome to this video. Thanks for clicking the thumbnail. Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how to go live on both Facebook Live and YouTube Live at the same time using Restream Live Studios. So if you're new to the channel, I invite you to say hello in the comments. Uh, my name is Rob Balasabas, and so I create a lot of videos that help content creators understand tools and strategies to reach their target audience and also how to build a business around their content and their audience that they're building here on YouTube and on social media. So I'd love for you to subscribe. And if this video is helpful, please make sure you give it a like as well. All right. So let's jump in and uh, let's talk about how to go live on both Facebook and YouTube at the same time using Restream Live Studio. So I'm going to share my screen here. Uh, one of the first things that I want to mention is that this is a really common question that I get all the time. I find that a lot of people are going live. Um, if they're going live on Facebook or YouTube, I find that the next Thing that they think about is how do I go live on more channels and the second channel that they usually think of going live into is either Facebook or YouTube so if they've been going live on Facebook Facebook live in a group or a page the next thing that they think about when they want to expand their audience and their reach using their live streams is that they want to go live on YouTube and vice versa if they've been doing a lot of live streams on YouTube they're like okay how do I get more viewers, how do I reach more people, more, more of my audience using live streams, and then naturally they think about going live on Facebook. And so that's why we're doing this here today. So the first thing I want to mention is that when it comes to live streaming on uh, Restream Live Studios to both Facebook and YouTube, what you will need is to get set up on Restream.io first. So if you go down in the description, there's going to be a link to get set up with Restream.io. And the thing with going live on Facebook using Restream Live Studios is that you will need a paid Restream account. So you will need a standard Restream plan or higher, which is $19 a month. If you pay monthly, if you pay annually uh, upfront, it is uh, works out to about $16 a month. Now, I do have a coupon code that I've set up with the people at Restream down below, which gives you 25% off for the lifetime of your account on any of the paid plans. So go down to the link down below, you'll find the paid account and uh, you'll be ready to go. So once you set that up, uh, put a pause on this video, set that up, come back here. And what we'll do is we'll dive into the dashboard. And so this is my Restream dashboard. And so what you need to do now is set up what's called destinations. And so you actually end up right here, destinations. And so what you want to do is you want to add your channel. So we're going to add our Facebook page or group to Restream as a destination. And then we're also going to add YouTube as a destination on Restream Studios. All right. So first, what you want to do is click on the add channel button right there on the top left. It's orange. Okay, and then now you're going to be clicking down here, Facebook Live right there, groups and public pages. Let's click on that. Let's click on connect Facebook. There's going to be a pop up right here. I'm going to make it a little bit bigger so you guys can all see it. So there's going to be a pop up right here and it's going to ask you to select the profile that you want to live stream to and add as a destination on Restream Studios. And so I'm going to add my Facebook group here, the Content Marketers Cafe. You don't need to click on continuous live stream. That's not necessary. And then once you're done that, just click on save. And it's going to ask you to add the Restream app to your Facebook group, which is totally fine, totally safe. Just click on that. It's going to take you to your Facebook group. It's already added. So I'm good to go. Close the Facebook uh, tab. And when you come back to Restream, you'll notice now that this Facebook group is now a destination here on Restream Studios. So that's really as easy as it is. It's as easy as it looks, actually. So uh, your Facebook group is now added. Now, if you want to add your Facebook page, it's the exact same process. You just need to change. You just need to select your Facebook page instead of a Facebook group in the drop down that I showed you. All right. So now let's add YouTube as a destination. Again, let's click on the orange add channel button on the top left. From here. 
you have two options. You can select YouTube events or you can select YouTube stream now. Now YouTube events is the selection that you will pick if you want to go live into a scheduled YouTube live. YouTube stream now is if you want to go live sort of like anytime, any day, uh, you know, just as a pop-up live, okay? So for the sake of this, it's really the same process of adding either YouTube events or YouTube stream now as a destination. So I, for this, let's choose the YouTube stream now option. So click on YouTube stream now. The nice thing about this is that all you need to do is click the red YouTube stream now button right here on the left-hand side. It's bright red, you can't miss it. You select the account that you want to go into, the YouTube account. You select your YouTube channel and you select allow right here on the bottom right and it is all good. This is pretty standard. Uh, you can read this if you want. If you want to slow it down as you're clicking through, you want to make sure you're you know, comfortable with the privacy policies and the terms of service and all those things. By all means, slow it down, read everything, but it's basically very, very standard. So click on allow. And there you go, it's all set. So now we have, you'll see here, we have our Facebook, Facebook group as a destination. And then we also have our YouTube stream now as a destination. Now, if you want to add YouTube uh, events as a destination, again, it's the exact same process. You click on add channel and you go through the exact same process as adding YouTube stream now. Okay, so now that you're all set up and you have all of both destinations, uh, Facebook and YouTube as a destination on Restream Studios, you are really ready to go live. So now what you want to do is you want to click on the live studio button right here on the left hand side. So right there, putting a little arrow there so you don't miss it. There's my video. I'm going to turn this video off because or this camera on Restream Studios off because there's just too many robs on the screen here. I'm gonna turn the microphone off as well. Okay, so now where you wanna go is setup. So right here on the top right, you wanna go on, click on setup right here on the top right. Okay, let's click setup. You need to put a title and, des and description. So the title and description is really what's gonna be ending up as your YouTube and your Facebook title and description as it shows up on YouTube and Facebook, okay? So just for example here, we'll put test, live, FB, and YouTube, and then test, live, FB, on YouTube on Restream Studios, okay? And now below that, you'll see all these destinations right here, right? So you see all these destinations, and each destination has a toggle right here on the right-hand side. And so essentially, the nice thing about Restream is that you can just toggle on and off which destinations you want to go live into. So right now I have YouTube and Facebook turned on. That's why you'll see the blue. It's turned on. The others are turned off. Okay. But if I wanted to, I could also go live into my LinkedIn profile. I could also go live into my Periscope or Twitter uh, uh, profile as well. All right. So it's really, really easy. You could go live and over all like to all of your channels if you really wanted to. But for the sake of this tutorial, we're gonna be uh, just showing you how to do this on YouTube and Facebook. All right, so now I've put my titles here and my description. I can click on update all right here. And the nice thing about that is that it essentially updates the captions and the title, sorry, the title and description for all of the destinations that I'm gonna be going live into, okay? Now here at the, uh, really at the bottom behind, sorry, below this screen. So this screen right here is what will show up on your broadcast. This is what's gonna show up on the screen. And then you've got a bunch of different options here to really like make your live stream really fancy, look really nice and, and professional. And so 
Uh, I have another video, so I'll put a, a link right above here or in the description to another video on my channel that goes really deep into how you can really optimize and, uh, sorry, not optimize, but really, you know, uh, customize, that's the word I was looking for, <laughs> customize your Restream Live Studio so that you can share your screen, you can have guests, you can have different views and things like that, split screens and all those really fancy things uh, for your live stream show. So go check this link right above here or the link down in the description. I'll put it that down there for you guys. All right, so now when you're ready, all you need to do is really click on the go live button right here and you'll be go good to go. You'll be going live to both Facebook and YouTube at the same time and it is ready to rock. All right, so uh, away we go there. So uh, I'm gonna be changing this screen again here. So there you go. So if you have any questions, by all means, let me know. Uh, that's what I'm here for. So leave a comment down below. Uh, always happy to answer any questions that you guys may have. And make sure to go check out that other video uh, that I'll put right here. Actually, no, I'll put it right here. I'll put it right here. Go check out this video. It'll show you how to really make your live streams look really crisp and fancy and professional uh, inside of Restream Live Studios. All right, take care. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.